this is a kalpana here in this video we are going to solve a differential equation so let's get started problem solve x minus y log y plus y log x into dx plus x times log y minus log x into dy equals to 0 solution given differential equation is Given differential equation x minus y log y plus y log x into dx plus x times log y minus log x into dy equals to 0. You can write this as x times log y minus log x into dy equals to we'll take this to rhs so you'll get minus of x minus y log y plus y log x into dx okay this is equals to minus x minus into minus plus y log y minus into plus minus y log x into dx. Okay. Again, you can also write this as y log y minus y log x minus x into dx. We are having x into log y minus log x into dy equals to y log y minus y log x minus x into dx. This becomes x times log y minus log x into dy equals to now take y common from the first two terms of RHS. We will get y times log y minus log x minus x into dx. Since we know that log a minus log b equals to log a by b. Okay, now you can apply this to log y minus log x. Okay, then this becomes x times log y minus log x can be written as log y by x into dy equals to y times log y minus log x can be written as log y by x minus x into dx. Okay. Now this becomes dy by dx equals to y log y by x minus x by x log y by x. Now take x common from the numerator. You can write the numerator as x times y by x since you don't have any x term in this first term okay you don't have any x in this first term so what we'll do is we'll simply multiply x by x okay it will be easy to take x common from these two terms fine so if you take x common you'll get y by x log y by x minus 1 
by x log y by x. So now it's easy to cancel x from numerator is equals to y by x log y by x minus 1 by log y by x. Then dy by dx equals to y by x log y by x minus 1 by log y by x. So now we'll check this function is in homogeneous or not. So let f of x equals to f of x and y. Function of x and y equals to this expression. y by x into log y by x minus 1 by log y by x. Okay. Now we have to check whether f of kx ky equals to f of xy or not. If f of kx ky equals to f of xy then we can say that this function is homogeneous. Okay. So f of kx and ky equals to simply replace x by kx and y by ky. Then you will get ky by kx into log ky by kx minus 1 by log ky by kx. So here k gets cancelled, right? So this equals to y by x into log y by x minus 1 by log y by x, which is a function of x and y. This equals to function of x, y, right? So therefore, function of kx, ky equals to function of x, y. So from this we can say that this function is homogeneous. If the function is homogeneous, then we can say that the given differential equation, this differential equation is homogeneous. Okay, now we will solve this homogeneous differential equation. Let y equals to vx. Now differentiate it on both sides with respect to x. Then dy dx of y equals to dy dx of vx. Then dy by dx equals to dv by dx. Since we know that u v whole dash equals to u dash v plus v dash u, right? So differentiate u v, uh, u, sorry, vx using this formula. You get derivative of v with respect to x into x plus derivative of x with respect to x into v which is equals to x into dv by dx plus derivative of x with respect to x is 1 into v is v, right? So we have dy by dx equals to v plus x into dv by dx and y equals to vx, right? We have y equals to vx and dy by dx equals to v plus x into dv by dx. Now, we'll replace y and dy by dx in the homogeneous differential equation. Then this becomes v plus x into dv by dx equals to put y by x, sorry, put y equals to vx, then you get vx by x into log We'll just replace y, okay? 
3 plus y by dx, then you'll get dx by x minus 1 by log dx by x. So here x gets cancelled. Then b plus x into dv by dx equals to b log v minus 1 by log v. Okay. Now take this y to RHS. You'll get x into dv by dx equals to v log v minus 1 by log v minus v. Is equals to v log v minus 1 minus v times log v by log v. Then x into dv by dx equals to here v log v minus v log v gets cancelled. You get minus 1 by log v. Now we'll write functions of v and differential dv on one side and functions of x and dx, differential dx on the other side. Then you can write this as log v into differential dv equals to minus 1 into 1 by x into dx. Okay. You get log v dv equals to minus 1 by x into dx. So here the variables are separable, right? So now we can perform integration on both sides. Then, integral log v into dv equals to minus integral 1 by x into dx. Since we know that, integral log x dx equals to x log x minus x plus c and integral 1 by x dx equals to log mod x plus integral constant c. Okay, now apply these formulae. You we'll get integral log v dv equals to v log v minus v equals to Minus integral 1 by x dx is log mod x plus integral constant c. We are having v log v minus v equals to minus log x plus c, right? Since we are having y equals to vx, from this, we will get v equals to y by x. Now, we can replace v by y by x. Then this becomes y by x into log y by x minus y by x equals to minus log x plus c. Then, so now take y by x common from these two terms and you'll get y by x times log y by x minus 1 equals to minus log x plus c. Now it's easy to take x, right? x to RHS. Then y times equals to minus x log x plus cx. Okay. 
We know that log a by b equals to log a minus log b. Then you can write log y by x as log y minus log x. Right? And this will remain the same. Okay? Minus 1 remain the same. This becomes y into log y is y log y minus y into log x y log x minus 1 into y minus y equals to minus x log x plus x. Okay, now take this to LHS, we'll get x log x plus y log y minus y log x and also this y to RHS we we'll get y plus x okay so you are you are having x log x and y log x right x log x and minus y log x so from these two we can take log x common Okay, we'll get x minus y into log x. Okay, simply we are taking log x common from these two terms. Plus, the middle term will be as it is equals to y plus cx. Which is the general solution of the given differential equation. You can also write this as y log y plus x minus y times log x equals to y plus cx. This is the general solution of the given equation. Okay, you can consider it as one general solution of one. So this completes the problem. So we have seen a problem from homogeneous differential equation in this video. Hope you will understand. We will see you in the next video. Until then. Bye bye.